Hello and welcome back everyone. Sean McKenna here from Tech Blab and welcome to part six of our Cam Twist tutorials. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to do an image overlay. You can use this for a lower third to promote your social media or just simply have your brand on screen like we do in our Tech Blab show. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so let's go ahead and add an image overlay. And then right here where it says image, the square, we are going to take our image, drag it and drop it in. So there we go. And under position, we can grab this little dot and actually move it around a little bit. So to line it up with Blab, we really need to actually jump in and do a Blab really quick. So let's go ahead and do a test Blab. Okay, so there we go. Let's open Cam Twist back up and work on our positioning. Let's move it this way a little bit. Let's shrink it down. And there we go. Now that looks really good on the desktop, um, but make sure you get a mobile phone and you test it on the mobile device as well. You can always just go to your own blab while sitting here. So that will work. Uh, the image size, don't make it too big of an image, otherwise it will be slightly pixelated. And I know it looks backwards to you, but that's good. That means it looks correct to everyone else. For some reason, blab kind of reverses things a little bit. So you can change the transparency right here and kind of make things more of a see-through color like that. You can rotate it. Uh, you can do all kinds of different options and stuff. You can also turn it off just by tapping the check. You can save this as a setup, uh, but I leave this empty space right here. I like to do things such as a countdown, and I can take the little countdown timer and toss it right here in the middle. And so there you go. Simple as that. You could put an image down here at the bottom. You can put one over here. You can put text in here. I'm going to leave a sample overlay, just a blank image with the same size that I have this one on, uh, in the description below. You can download it, play around with it, and all that. I'm going to do a couple more videos on other things and other ways you can use this, but for the most part, it's pretty straightforward and simple. Just make sure the image is not too large because when you use the scale item right here, it will actually get really pixelated and people won't be able to read it as easy. For TechBlab, I actually have a few different ones, so let's take the countdown off. You can also do a lower thirds type item if you like. Promoting your Facebook group or whatever it may be. So you really do have a lot of options. This is the very simple one if you want to take your whole screen. Uh, it really depends on what you want to do. You can also fill your make a square image and fill the entire screen if you'd like to. It's really up to you. The possibilities are endless. I'll see you in the next video.